Aidan, please, at that point. Uh, next up, we have James and his friend, little Jim, uh, doing a ventriloquist act. Uh, they are both very well known around the West Midlands and uh, did actually perform at the first relaxed uh, musical concert at the Town Hall. So, James and little Jim. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yeah, it's great to be here at the uh, Birmingham NEC for the autism show tonight. I mean, this afternoon. Now, as you all know, my name is James Rowney, and this is my good friend, Little Jim. Well, say hello, Little Jim. Hello. Not me, them. Oh, yeah, sorry. Hello there. Hello, 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 Little Jim. What? Look, when I say hello to everyone, just say hello to everyone, but only once. I didn't expect you to do this individually. Oh, why didn't you say so in the first place then? Anyway, hello! Hello! Look, oh, that was a bit disappointing, wasn't it? Come on, you can do better than that! Hello! Hello! Oh, that's smashing! So this is the autism show, is it? Well, yes it is, little Jim. Oh, what's that exactly? Well, how do I put this? Um, well, the Autism Show, well, it's a special kind of show that's based for people on the autistic spectrum. You mean autistic people, like paintings and drawings and that sort of thing? No, autistic people. Are you autistic? Well, I did do a painting of you the other day, and it's over there. Do you want to have a look? Yeah, go on. What do you think? <laughs> oh, I see now. You're autistic! <laughs> anyway, can I ask you something? What? Sure, little Jim. What is it? I'm all ears. Well, I bought some sweets yesterday and I went to put them in the cupboard. But while I went to the cupboard this morning, James... Oh, yeah, sorry. Um, what is it? Well, I discovered they have gone! But what are you suggesting, little Jim? Did you have them? No. Are you sure? Yes. Did you stop them? No. Did you do your belly? No. Look you in the eye and say that, greedy gods. What? Look you in the eye? Yeah. Um, I really don't do look in the eye, so uh, shall we move on? Yeah, I think we should. Anyway, how's school? Well, it's not bad, but there's only one small problem. Really? What's that? Well, it's about my teacher. Yeah, what about her? Well, she doesn't like me. Oh dear, what? why doesn't she like you? She picks on me. Oh, well that's a bit unusual. How does she pick on you? Well, I'll tell you. All right then, we're all listening. Let's see what you got. Well, one day at school, I raised my hand and asked the teacher if I could go to the toilet. Yes, so? So the teacher said, No, you should have got a break time. <laughs> oh, oh dear, then, then what happened next? Well, I didn't mind. I realised that, but we're at an other emergency situation here. Yes, 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 yes. Um, and then what happened next? And then the teacher said, If you can recite the whole alphabet, you can go to the toilet. And so I stood up and said A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O Q R S T V W X Y Z. And then the teacher said, What's happened to the P? And then I said, It's trickling down my leg and it's out of my socks. Little Jim. What? Do you know, I have to say, that was just disgusting. Oh, come on, I just couldn't help it. Well, I know you couldn't, but next time if you want to go to the toilet, just do it at break time and not during class. It's okay. Okay, you say so. Of course I say so. Stick yourself. 
<laughs> anyway, yeah. how does it pick on you in any other way? Well, it is, but it sounds silly me saying this. Well, go on, I'm just saying. Well, I did get the attention to ask you a question. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, what question was it? Well, we were doing science in school, and the teacher said, what sort of meat do we get in birdies? And then one of the kids said, chicken. And the other one said, turkey. And then the teacher said, what do we get from pink, pinky, pinkies? But, yeah, I know it sounds funny, but he's still a primary school. <laughs> one of the kids said, bacon. And the other one said, pork. And then the teacher said, what do we get? From a big fat cow. And then I said, Homework! <laughs> Oi! What? Joe, you know, I'd say that was rude. You know, I'm not surprised you got detention for it. <sighs> Do you know, you really need to straighten up. Oh, come on, I was only having. Well, you may be joking, little Jim, but I do not think that was funny. Well, do you want to hear a joke? Do you want to hear a joke? Yeah. Yes, all right, go on, but you will have to make this quick because we are running out of time. Okay. So, if I have a green ball in my right hand and another green ball in my left hand, what do I get? Well, I don't know, little Jim. What do you get if you have a green ball in your right hand and another green ball in your left? Well, yes. you get uh-huh. Curling the frog, begging the mercy! <laughs> right, that is it. Oi, what are you doing? Oi, 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 what? Joe, you, know, you caused me a lot of trouble, little Jim. I'm going to have to put you back in the box. No, I meant the one backstage. Well, that's a shame. And why is that? Because this one's got my iPad in there. <laughs> well, you could do without it, because I want you to think about how you could behave at school properly, little Jim. Anyway, I'm really sorry about that. Um, just before I go, you can check out me and little Jim on James and Jim's Comedy Company, if any of you have Facebook, at www.facebook.com forward slash James and Jim. And, um, you can also press the like button to keep in touch for any more details on future gigs at different venues and anything like that. And of course, we also have our own YouTube channel, so you can check it out from there. Anyway, you've been a fabulous audience, and goodbye! Let's hear it for James and little Jim. Now, the 